Neil Armstrong's first step on the moon was a giant leap for mankind, but it was also the beginning of an unexpected battle against lunar dust. The moon's dust isn't like Earth dirt. It's incredibly fine. Most lunar dust is much finer than a human hair, often smaller than two microns. And because there's no wind or water erosion, the particles are jagged and glassy. This dust is also electrostatically charged from exposure to solar wind, so it clung to everything. Once inside the lunar module, the astronauts reported it smelled distinctly like burnt gunpowder and gave them sore throats. Even worse, its abrasive nature caused significant wear. It was responsible for scratching helmet visors and eroding the outer layers of spacesuits, compromising critical seals. Today, as we prepare to return to the moon, NASA has a modern solution to this problem, the electrodynamic dust shield. This technology revives the electric curtain concept first developed by NASA in the 1960s, creating an invisible electric wave that literally sweeps dust away from a surface. The EDS is highly efficient. It uses less power than a 20-watt light bulb and can be integrated into everything from solar panels to camera lenses, ensuring our future missions are safe and successful. The lessons learned from the Apollo astronauts' battle with lunar dust are directly fueling the innovation that will make future lunar exploration safer. The original problem now has a modern solution. The legacy of Apollo isn't just a moment in the past, it's the foundation for our future. If you're as passionate about space exploration as we are, give this video a like and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.